Hi everyone, this is Tom Dieter with Web2Center.com. Uh, today is January 16th, 2008, and we're going to be talking about Feedmate. This is a free service that allows your blog to be accessible on mobile devices. I will post a resource page at www.web2center.com forward slash Feedmate, and that's spelled just like the name of this company, F-E-E-D-M, the number 8. Okay, so what Feedmate really does is uh, allows your blog to be accessible on mobile devices, um, but what's unique is it does so in a way that looks very professional and is customizable for you. Um, it allows you to put um, the colors of your blog, your color scheme, as well as your logo right into the feed that people will be looking at on their mobile device. It also gives you some shortcuts to making your blog um, show up on the list of blogs that are accessible via mobile devices. So that's what I'm going to show you. It's very simple to set up. Um, the first thing you do is add a feed. We've already done that and here it is, social marketing strategies. And when you do that what you're going to get is a page that looks similar to the ones going to pop up here. Okay. Um, basically you just go in and you put your feed URL. Of course we use FeedBurner so there's our feed URL. You choose a mobile shortcut and so that's what we've chosen right there, feedmate.com at Web2Center. And then you uh, pick a name. Instead of using Web2Center.com, I chose Social Marketing Strategy, which is what our blog is mainly about. A very brief description. Um, and then you save that down here, and then you go on to Display. This is really where you get to customize the uh, mobile feed that you can send out to these um, mobile devices. Um, the first thing you can choose is thumbnails or text links and then you upload some sort of banner image um, basically I just uploaded the header and it formatted it for me and you can see it show up right over here you choose your background text and highlight colors um, and these sort of match what we use on web2center.com you save that and then you go on to advanced and there's a couple things you want to you have to decide how many items per page I chose five I like to see item descriptions whenever I'm browsing an, an RSS reader whether it be on my laptop or mobily um, the item description the max length I always like to see the entire excerpt um, so it allows you to select zero if, if you want to have no limit so that way people will see the entire excerpt that I've chosen to add to my post um, this last thing, I'm not really sure what it is, so uh, I won't talk about that. But if you look here to the left, um, this is kind of what your your blog is going to look like on their mobile device. So you can see with the color added and the formatting and the logo at the top, it looks very professional. And then you have all of the you have the option there to see the entire excerpt, which is always nice. One thing I want to point out while we're looking at this display is uh, the way FeedMate. Um, supports itself is through revenue or ad share so um, of course the first thing you're going to see after the logo and your title or description is an ad and then the last thing you're going to see as people scroll through is another is another ad down here so um, just want to be aware of that there are some ads on what you what you view but I think it's well worth it because it really creates a nice uh, custom professional looking feed on mobile devices. Alright, there's a couple of other important things to know um, about FeedMate. Um, services that it provides that uh, I think are valuable. Uh, we're going to click on site integration and what they've done is made it real easy to add the proper code to your blog so that it's even more accessible um, with mobile devices. The first thing they've done is um, given you the code to put in your HTML header um, and that header will make your site accessible to mobile users and search engines. So um, when people are searching for blogs that are accessible or formatted for mobile devices, you're going to have the right header in there to, to trigger you, your blog to be on that list. And then the, the next thing that makes it um, real simple to allow your uh, your subscribers to view your blog on their mobile device in this professional manner is they've given you a PHP script 
to add in so that if anybody um, uses their, let's say they use their iPhone and they type in web2center.com, instead of seeing that tiny, tiny little text um, with the iPhone browser trying to show them the entire page, they're going to skip right over to your, your mobile view. So it's going to be that nice professional custom view that we saw on the last little screen. Um, obviously these scripts are very simple to install. Um, why don't I show you that real quick. We'll just pop on over to our blog and you'll notice here is the script that I've installed. Um, I guess I, I didn't show you this yet but they make these buttons um, real easy. They just give you the code and the button pops up um, and you just put it in some sort of text widget or something in your sidebar and that instantly makes your blog available. Um, to mobile devices. So that's uh, the one thing. And then the other thing is, I'll pause this so I don't bore you as I head over to the theme editor. I'll be right back. Okay, so here I am inside the theme editor of the this WordPress blog. Um, so you get an idea, you go to presentation theme editor, and then uh, here I am, I'm in the header, um, the header code. So. I've labeled this just to give you a better idea of what it is. This is where I put the FeedMate code uh, right before um, my blog title shows up. And this is that code that uh, triggers the search engines to know that this um, blog can be read on a mobile device. And then here's the PHP script that automatically redirects anybody that's um, trying to view web2center.com on a mobile device to the mobile feed so it looks nice and professional. Okay, um, so how that's how that works. And then why don't I go ahead and show you real quick here, if I can, where I've put that little button that you can get directly from your FeedMate account. And so it'll show up nice and pretty on your blog with your other RSS feed options. All right, so, uh, and I apologize, any of you pure coders out there, this is probably not the way to add buttons and links to your blog, but this is how I do it. So here I've got it in a text widget and as soon as this thing opens up I will show you. And This is where all of our RSS feed options are inside this one little box. And we're going to scroll down. This is the regular um, RSS feed through FeedBurner. Uh, then we've got our subscribe by email feed through FeedBurner. And then we have the, the FeedMate feed. So I'll highlight it in case you need more of an option. So this whole thing right here is creates that little button that we saw that said mobile. So that's kind of how it looks. And um, I'll try to post a little bit more information on the resource page at web2center.com forward slash feedmate spelled f-e-e-d-m and then the number eight alright so that's the hard part uh, one more thing that I'd like to show you and maybe something that will get you excited about uh, installing this mobile um, this mobile button on your blog um, what's interesting is that feedmate although it's supported by ads is also offering a little bit of an affiliate incentive and that is they will give you ten dollars on every referral that makes twenty dollars from advertising for them and, or they'll give you fifty dollars for any referral that makes a hundred dollars in advertising for them a um, couple of other little stipulations here but basically um, this might be a good idea to go ahead and uh, get on the ground floor as they say with mobile um, access because as we all know more and more people are buying iPhones we've got the rumors of the G phone which would, will, is supposed to be much cheaper and, and perhaps free to, to a lot of people because of the ad sponsoring on the phone. So more and more people are going to be accessing content, especially blogs and forums, via um, their mobile devices. So it's a good idea to go ahead and offer that option to all of your subscribers. Um, and I guess last of all, it's kind of cool that FeedMate has built in a stats or a tracking um, set into their service so let's take a quick look and we just installed this uh, I don't know maybe a, a week ago so let's look at our stats 
this way. All right, so our stats are growing. All right, so we installed it on the 11th, and we've got some pretty significant traffic already. Um, so it's kind of nice to watch. And so I guess that's it. Um, if you have any questions, go ahead and visit uh, web2center.com forward slash feedmate, F-E-E-D, M, and then the number 8, just like the way the company is spelled. And um, then also, I always like to remind everybody, if you have any comments, please, please go ahead and put those below um, this, this video. And also, if you have any suggestions for another weekly video from web2center.com, go ahead and put those in the comments and we'll get right on it. We do these every week. All right, thanks and have a great day.